Hi everyone and hope you are doing fine. Today I would like to show you if you click on a game object how it can change its color to a random generated color by using I mean using C sharp script. So first of all let's create a cylinder and then let's create a material and name this material color and then let's change the color into very light pink then click on cylinder drag this color to our cylinder and now you can see that it's a little bit pinky like very light pink so the next thing we need to do is to create a c-sharp script and name it change color randomly or anything that makes sense to you uh, this script is going to generate random colors so we don't need the start function but we need the update function because every time we click it's going to update the function uh, update the color here yeah. so if input get mouse button down so every time we press the mouse button and we, here inside the mouse button function we need to write the button number uh, whether we want to use the left button or right button or scroll so the left button is zero and here we are going to since we are going to attach this C sharp script uh, to our um, game objects uh, we are going to write this it means the uh, this object that the script is attached uh, get component um renderer sorry and yep with capital letter and material the material color if you remember we create the material and we are going to change the color of the material so uh, here we are going to say it should be equal to color that we can use any of these colors but it won't change um, randomly all we want is to generate a random color for our game object every time we click so we can uh, use this function hsv to rgb and we can see that it takes three float um, uh, parameters and uh, here the parameter h uh, is from 0 to 1 and uh, let's uh, say um, just close the function and put two places okay we have three places and we are not going to enter any number here because we want it to generate random numbers so we'll use unity's random uh, generator number like random dot range we want the range to start from zero and goes to one but uh, since a uh, random range uses uh, like an integer a number uh, we will use this um, f next to them so it will uh, generate uh, floating numbers and uh, we will copy this um, function into uh, the other like parameter places okay uh, looks correct to me so far so let's save the script and go back to unity the next thing we need to do is to connect this script to our game object we will drag this here and let's save our scene to scene one and let's play the game you can see every time you click on the game objects it just generates nice beautiful random colors yep thanks for watching